The giants are still here, but in their spiritual form. They are now called evil spirits. The giants are still here, but they are in their spiritual form. But now we call them evil spirits. You know, as you guys, as I read through the book of Enoch, it makes a whole heap of, whole heap of things clear that we read about in the Bible. Like from the days of Noah, why God really destroyed the earth because a whole of wickedness was upon the earth. And some of those wickedness was what Azazel and all the other fallen ones taught humankind. And the entire earth got corrupted. But one thing that really, really was made so much clear to me was where did evil spirits came from? Okay, so I always wonder that. Where did the evil spirits came from? You know, and you know, why are they here doing all these things? Who made them? You know, at first I thought that Satan was the one that made them, but no. These are children of the fallen angels. I'm going to go into a scripture here. We're going to go into a text here in the book of Enoch to make that much more clear. And it says here in the book of Enoch, chapter 4, 15, actually, verse 8, it says, And now the giants who were who were born from body and flesh will be called evil spirits on the earth and on the earth will be their dwelling and so we see here where the, this evil spirit that, that are not that, that are now here tormenting humanity they came from the giants so when the flood came and destroyed these giants physically spiritually they were still here roaming the earth and many of them are still here roaming the earth same way same way under the powers are under the control of Satan. And let's continue to read it here. And it says here, And evil spirits came from their flesh, because from above they were created, and from the holy watchers were their origin and first foundation. Evil spirits will they be will they be on the earth, and the spirit of the evil ones they will be called. And the dwelling of the spirit is in heaven. Sorry. And the dwelling of the spirits of heaven is heaven. But the dwelling of the spirits of the earth where who were born on the earth is earth. That's why they're here. And the spirits of the giant do wrong, are corrupt, attack, fight, and break on the earth and cause sorrow. And they eat no food, no, do not thirst, and are not observed. So they are not what? They are not seen. Even though people with spiritual eyes can see them. And so you see here that these spirits are still here with us. And these are, these are the giants of all in their spiritual form. Fighting against us, attacking us. Just like what they did back in time past. They fought, they, they fought, they attacked, they devoured, they created havoc. And this is what they're doing now on the spiritual level. They're fighting against us, attacking us, creating havoc care creating sorrow spirit of depression all these spirits they are from these evil spirits which are giants in their spiritual form so they're still here with us people they're still here with us it's highly recommend that you go through the spirit uh, get, go through the book of enoch as you go through the scripture as well because these things will become much more clearer to you certain things will become much more clear to you and i will be doing videos on these as well I do I do videos also on my I do extended versions and um on my on my other channel called Perfecting the Saints Ministry. But I'm gonna also do some small clips here and small videos here on the book of Enoch as well. So they are still here with us. But it's a beautiful thing about it. Go and read Matthew chapter ten and verse one. We have power over them. We have authority over evil spirits by the blood of Jesus Christ. In the name of of our Lord Jesus Christ. Once you have the indwelling of the, once you have the Holy Spirit inside of you, you have powers over these evil spirits. That's the beauty about it. Until next video, shalom and peace, man.